While there's a variety of sewing machines available, they all operate on the same principle, allowing you to create your projects quickly and precisely. It's essential to grasp sewing machine basics as they enable us to operate any sewing machine model effectively. This is part two of the sewing machine overview. Introduction to your sewing machine. In this lesson, we'll start with the fabric working parts. Locate the thread sources. Explore other key components. And finish with finding sewing machine manuals for further guidance. Sewing machines come in different shapes and sizes, but they all operate on the same basic principle. They use a threaded needle to create a stitch. By passing the thread through the fabric and interlocking it with another thread on the underside of the fabric. This stitch is what holds the fabric together and creates the finished product. While there may be variations in feature and design, the basic mechanics of a sewing machine are the same across most models. The first component of a sewing machine is the needle, which is used to pierce the fabric and create the stitch. Needles come in different sizes and shapes, depending on the type of fabric and the desired stitch. The needle is attached to a needle bar, which moves up and down to create the stitch. The fabric is held in place by a feed mechanism, which moves the fabric forward with each stitch. The second component of a sewing machine is the bobbin, which holds the thread that interlocks with the top thread to create the stitch. The bobbin is placed in a bobbin case. The top thread is threaded through the machine and the needle, while the bobbin thread is threaded through the bobbin case and placed under the needle plate. The final component of a sewing machine is the motor, which powers the machine and controls the speed of the needle. The motor is connected to a foot pedal, which allows the user to control the speed of the machine with their foot. Some machines may have additional features, such as automatic threading or stitch selection, but these are variations on the basic components that make up a sewing machine. In general, despite variations in features and designs, sewing machines predominantly adhere to fundamental principles. Gaining a grasp of these principles and the essential components of a sewing machine empowers users proficiently manage and uphold their machines, enabling them to effortlessly undertake a diverse array of projects and garment creations. Should you ever desire or require a more in-depth understanding of the machine's parts, you can conveniently turn to your sewing machine's manual. Many renowned sewing machine brands provide access to their manuals on their official websites. For those utilising older models, a practical approach is to enter your sewing machine model along with the keyword manual into your preferred search engine, which often yields downloadable PDF instructions. That's all for now. In this lesson, 
we covered essential sewing machine terms you'll encounter in resources on sewing. Additionally, we discussed where to find manuals online if you don't have a physical copy. In the next lesson, we'll take a closer look at the process of creating a stitch.